Oh, we look to the sun Set our eyes on our Savior See the image of love Sing His praises forever Oh, we look to the sun Oh, we look to the sun Tearing through the dead of night See the kingdom burst into color At the speed of light yeah. Freedom Shaking up the atmosphere As the shadow fades into nothing As the day of Beyond the sky so above Now reaching out for us The everlasting one Jesus our God Oh, we look to the sun Set our eyes on our Savior See the image of love Sing His praises forever Waking up to kingdom come See the hope of heaven Shining like the rising sun Now forever Lifted up from death to life There's no fear in love At the darkness in his endless light Jesus Beyond the skies above, love reaching out for us, the everlasting one, Jesus our God. Come on. Oh, we look to the sun, set our eyes on our Savior, see the image of love, sing His praises forever. Hi UG kids, it's Pastor Gio here. Do you like my helmet? Me too. I once hiked the mountain with a group of friends. We were so relieved that we had finished the national exam and we wanted to celebrate and get fresh air. So we all decided to hike a mountain, barbecue and hang out. As we were hiking, we were just in awe of the scenery. We were surrounded by trees and vegetation. It was awesome. It felt like an adventure. As I was walking, I was distracted by the stream I saw. I went to the stream and rested for a bit while enjoying the scenery of trees. But suddenly, I realized that I was separated from the group because no one had followed me. I was lost. I didn't have my phone with me. I walked down the path and shouted for my friends hoping that we could reunite at the foot of the mountain but no one could hear me. I kept walking till I ran into this man. He was also hiking this mountain going the opposite direction. He realized I was separated from my group and guess what he said. Find out after the video. We continue our story of David, God's new chosen king of Israel. He did what was right and fair for God's chosen people of Israel. One day, it came to David's mind. King Saul was my enemy, but Jonathan, his son, my best friend. Is there anyone alive from that family? For David had made a promise to show kindness to Jonathan's descendants. Although he is now lame, one son is still present. My king, I bring good news. There is one son. He is still alive. 
but he cannot walk. His name is Mephibosheth, and he lives just around the block. Go and bring me Mephibosheth. Bring him here to Jerusalem so that I can show him kindness and I can fulfill my promise to them. And so Mephibosheth was brought to Jerusalem where with King David he met. He bowed down before the king for he did not know if this was a threat. Do not be afraid, Mephibosheth, for I have made a promise to your father, Jonathan, that I might show his family kindness. I will give to you all the land that belonged to your grandfather Saul. Servants will take care and farm the land. You will eat with me and never wonder. Why would you show such kindness? For my grandfather was your enemy. But your father was my best friend, and he was very good to me. From then on, Mephibosheth lived at the palace and ate his meals at the king's table. He was like one of his sons. And that's the end of this story from the Bible. So that man, he said, hey, take that pat on the left. That would lead to your friends. I saw them a while back. Take my water. It will take you two hours to reach the bottom. I was so surprised and also relieved. That stranger showed me kindness by pointing the direction and even gave his water. If it wasn't because of him, who knows? I would probably still be lost. Just like this man, but in a greater way. Jesus showed kindness by showing us the way and gave his life so that we can be with him forever. Isn't that so amazing? Well, I had an awesome time with you guys. See you in our Zoom classes this afternoon, but before that, let's pray. Heavenly Father, we just thank you that you are a kind God and you love us so much. Open our hearts and minds to receive your wisdom today. Bless everyone in Jesus' name. Everyone say, Amen. I'll see you guys.